For a young kid who started looking at IPL, you know, coming into the stadium, watching them play from the stands and being a ball boy. So obviously playing for RCB is, is a dream. Big Basket Now presents RCB Bowl Diaries. My first memory playing at the Chinnaswamy Stadium would be, you know, as young kids we used to come for the trials. Only the finals used to happen in Chinnaswamy Stadium. So that was the first game I played under 16 zonals. So when I walked in as a kid, under 16, playing that first game, right? In my mind it was always like it was a packed stadium and then I was just walking in and then people were looking at me. So from there, when I stepped in, when I got my cap for the RCB, and uh, when I walked in, actually there was full pack stadium. It was like a deja vu feeling for me. When I walked in, I still thought about you know the under 13 days where I kept telling myself that you know one day I'm, I want to play here. When it's April 15th, actually it feels like a birthday to me because it's like my dream, like my dream coming true, right? And that too playing in Chinnaswamy Stadium. I can never forget about my first wicket, obviously because uh, it was David Warner's wicket and more importantly it was got by Virat Bhai. So it's a special feeling because first wicket was involved with the greatest of greatest cricketers and that too in Chinnaswamy Stadium. So obviously playing for RCB is, is a dream. For a young kid who started looking at IPL, you know, coming into the stadium, watching them play from the stands and being a ball boy and then, you know, looking at Virat Bhai and wanting a picture from him and then, you know, sharing a dressing room, playing a game together. It's always a special feeling. So I think April 15th will always be, you know, very, very close to my heart because I made my debut and that too, especially for RCB. You know, I could finally tell my mom to stop working because uh, she had worked all her life. I could, you know, finally tell her, Ma, it's enough, you've done enough for me, so it's time for you to just watch me play. Because my parents are biggest cricket fans I could ever come across. My dad, until under 19, he used to come and watch every zonal game, every state game of mine. Whether I'm playing in Bangalore or Andhra or wherever it is, he used to travel. My dad always tells me that my mom doesn't watch me bowl. She comes for the game, she's here. As soon as my bowling comes, she goes inside. She's just walking around. She's not watching. As soon as she hears the crowd goes mad and then she'll see if there's a wicket and then she'll get excited and then she starts clapping. Now, whenever, you know, people recognize them saying, oh, you're uh, Vaishak's parents, it's so nice to meet you. They always uh, tell me that, you know, I was feeling so proud. I keep telling them I am very proud to be their son. Bas ye bolna. Yehi tumhara hai. Yeah, that's it. Sahi hai. Now delivering in 10 minutes. Playing alongside with Virat Bhai, Siraj Bhai and all, it's a very special feeling for any cricketer. Obviously, you're playing with the best in the world. The first game I did really well and uh, everybody said, well done, well done. But the second game when I got hit, you know, Siraj Bhai came and told me, this is how cricket is, you should just remain constant. So I've learned the biggest lesson in my life from him. I was signed in as an intern, as a net bowler. But, uh, you know, Adam Griffith played a really, I would say, supporting role for me to be where I am. He never saw me as a net bowler. He always kept telling me what to do, what not to do. That is where I felt like, you know what, I just belong here and I'm, I'm so grateful for that. Vaishak first stood out to us as, a, as an intern. He showed his competitiveness, I think, was well, probably one of the big things. But we've seen some great development, I think. His um, hunger for, for getting better is, is something that really stands out. I think we've seen a, an, an improvement in his fitness levels to a massive extent. Um, but also at training he wants to bowl, which is, which is a great trait to have. Um, Practising his skills at all times, competing at all times. Um, 
And if he's not quite nailing it, he's happy to stay on and, and do a little bit more to make sure he gets it right. Chinna Swami Stadium is always special for me because it's like a temple for me. So every time I walk in, it's just like walking into a temple. So I pray and I walk into the ground every time. And moreover, it's so special because I'm from here and you know, the people uh, chanting my name saying Vaishak, Vaishak. I know that they are my people and they are here to support me. They have played a huge role in me. They had given a chance for me to come back and you know, be a better version of myself. So yeah, hopefully, you know, I can deliver something to them. When I think I was about 12 years old, I was a ball boy and then there was this Afro-Asia Cup going on. So there was nets going on here, this side. Ganguly was batting and in the other net, Dhoni was batting. Before they used to tie the nets in such a way that there was a little bit of gap in between the two poles when they joined them. So when I ran in and that is when uh, Dada played a late cut to Shoaib Akhtar and it came straight in between those two poles. So it hit my rib and I just collapsed. Next minute I see everybody like in a group. I see Dhoni, I see Yuvraj Singh, I see Harbhajan Singh, I see, I see Dada. Everybody is here and then I, I woke up like a, it was like a dream I woke up to. And then after that everybody took me inside. I played table tennis with uh, Dada and uh, Dhoni and all of them. It was a very special feeling for a kid, especially for a ball boy. That was one of the finest memories, if I could recall, in Chinna Swami Stadium. Nim support Ivagle namge tumba important to. Nim support madre namge ino confidence barate. Hopefully, you know, it's matter of one win. One win bandre na momentum bandre na avgoto na vella match gelti vienta. Hope bit badi na kandita gedde gelti. Big Basket Now presents RCB Bowl Diaries.